Damaging a plug is fairly common, and of course, safety first, you'll need to replace it. But what's the safe way to change the plug? Unscrew and remove the cover of the plug. Unscrew the flex clamp. Loosen the terminal screws. Pull the wires away from the pins and remove the wire. Check the wires aren't damaged. And remove the fuse. Open the new plug and remove the fuse to make it easier to connect the wires. Feed the end of the flex under the clamp or between the flex grips. Connect the brown wire to the live terminal marked L on the right. Connect the blue wire to the neutral terminal marked N on the left. All appliances requiring an earth, there will be three wires to connect to the plug. Connect the green and yellow wire to the earth terminal marked E at the top. On double insulated appliances that don't require an earth, there will only be two wires to connect, live and neutral. Tighten all terminal screws. Make sure that the flex will be held firmly by the flex clamp. Tighten the flex clamp. Check that the ends of the wires are all pushed home. There shouldn't be any exposed wire. You can use the fuse from the old plug, but check you have the right fuse amperage for the appliance. Finally, screw on the cover and you're done. Important points to remember. Make sure the flex clamp is gripping the flex and not the core wires. Do check the cores are fully pushed home with the insulation right up to the terminals and that the screws are tight. Ensure you have the correct fuse with the right amperage. A standard three pin plug should carry the British standard kite mark. Oh, and make sure that you're using the correct fuse with the right amperage for the appliance.